Ivan, um, uh, good run out today. Uh, lots to be happy with on attack, but um, probably a couple of thing notes to make on defence as well. Um, speaking to Sean to Sean Everett as well, I think for for what it was today, um, walking away with with no injuries or no serious injuries, um, getting him some some good conditioning in the legs. Uh, there was some some good collision. Uh, I think structure was. I think both both sides will feel there's there's a bit of work. Um, I think the. I think there was about three times where we didn't really get their kick off so, and, and exit properly and I think they scored three tries from that so that's obviously an area, area we want to work on. Um, and then around the ruck I, I felt they, they exposed us quite a, quite a bit. Um, could be work rate, could be, could be system, um, we'll have a good look, good look at that but I think in the bigger picture um, you always want to win but getting scoring 43 points um, I, th- I think it's good for, for where we are currently Still two big weeks ahead of the first game. Um, not happy with the result, if, if you want to call it that, but, but for what we got, um, certain big moments, um, effort moments, I think it was good. Mm. You also struggled a little bit with their rolling ball at times as well. Um, is that... yeah. I think the first pack handled well. Um, I think and the, and the second one is a bit of work. Um, Roll clarity um, that we got to sort out there. But... Uh, Again, um, it's, it's one of the work-ons for us mm. after the, the, the previous season. Um, so to go that first 40 and uh, and get one or two solutions there, I think was good. But obviously, with the with the second pack, there's a bit of work. A lot was said, obviously, for, I mean, a lot of maybe a bit of consternation with your supporters for losing a bunch of guys like Carlo and Vincent and that in, in the last season. Um, do you feel that the guys who stepped up now um, have have sort of played take their place, and and you've still got a couple more to come that you had, didn't get exposed today? Yeah, I think you never want to lose guys locally, if, if, if I'm honest. Um, so losing them uh, to the Sharks is obviously obviously not nice. Um, I think someone like Vince is, is probably still at loss. Um, so again, one or two answers today around guys that could possibly fill the role for us. Um, there's also some, some new faces that we saw today, which, which is exciting. Um, youngsters, older guys coming back, um, joining from overseas, someone like Rion, for instance, unfortunately, the JP. Uh, broke his toe this week, so it would have been nice to see JP and everyone uh, together. But seeing guys like Zander, seeing guys like Sango, um, mm. I think it's nice, it's, it's exciting. Uh, Sango had a lovely run there at the end there as well, because snatched it almost for you there. Yeah, I think Zander was exceptional into the vacuum. Um, Sango had one or two brilliant moments, and, and you saw that through Varsity Cup, and you also saw that for Greek was in, in, in the Curry Cup. So he's got that bit of X Factor moment in him. Um, exciting time. Big season ahead. Um, just, I mean, there's, there's obviously uh, the workload's a bit different with a lot more to come this season as well. Do you feel you, you're in a good space where you are now two weeks before the start? Yeah, big season. Um, apart from the, the four European games that's on there, I think that the schedule is a little bit different this year where we're going to play over Christmas, play over New Year's. Second block, you know, we've got 10 consecutive games where seven is, is not at home um, with a fair bit of travel in there. So, um, I think preseason was good for us in, in terms of, of a solid conditioning and rugby base to, to, that should carry us through there. Uh, two big weeks for, for preparation for the Bulls. Though.